Hey everybody, it's the Musical Gamer again. Welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne. We've defeated Araman, the god that embodied the world of silence that Hikawa so wished to create. He's dead now. There's two left. So we'll ride the elevator up that was just past the room with Araman. And now enter a whole new portion of Kagatsuchi. Well, the tower of Kagatsuchi, I should say. We get to take a big elevator up to the next tier. So, let's do that. And the music changes a little bit. If I remember correctly, I think that hot chick here is, is here too. Damn, she's hot! Eh, uh, you would think that, Incubus. You would. If, uh, yes, haha. A fountain of life. Good to know. I had a feeling, I had a feeling there was going to be a fountain of life somewhere near here. I uh, don't know if I want to go down these hallways yet. Let's just go heal up real quickly. So, let's do this. I, whoa, I got lots of money. Yeah, I don't really have much of a problem with money right now. Um, okay. So. Let's go... Mm, let's actually go this way first. I think this is the way we need to go. Uh, do I have... I think I have float balls. I don't think I have anybody with Liftoma. But, uh, yeah, I got ten of these things. We're good. We are good. Uh, no, there's nothing there. What about up this way? Yeah, there's this cash cube here. An attack mirror. Nice. I will gladly take that. Is there anything more... Um, more that's worth a note? There's this doorway over here. Let's see what's through this door. Ah, another big room. Joy. Ooh, there's a mm, mystical chest. I'm wondering if... I'm gonna run from this. I'm wondering if at 6 Kagatuchi... Am I gonna get something good still from here? A pot of death! What? Okay. Yeah, I still got something good. Holy crap, did I still get something good. Uh, bullet time, go. With the Fountain of Life here, this is actually not, this is actually a pretty decent place to uh, maybe grind a little bit. If that's what you're interested in, if that tickles your fancy, then go ahead and do it. Hey, he dropped money. Unfortunately, that means we don't get to collect it. But, uh, oh well. C'est la vie, I suppose. I will gladly take the experience. Is there anything else... Worth of note through here. This door to the south looks interesting. Yeah. Oh God, hi Nix. I haven't seen you since um, <laughs> since the room in the second Kalpa. You give a nice chunk of experience too. I should have thought of recruiting her actually. I think I'm a high enough level to actually do it. Well, here's this door. Is there... There's a walkway over here. I don't even know if where I'm going is the right direction. All I know is that it is indeed a direction. Can I... I made it across that. Before... Ooh. Um... Oh, damn it. Well, at least I know with Glacial Blast... Everything here is weak to ice. And actually, those two thrones should be weak to death. And for whatever... Oh, damn it. And for whatever reason... Throne has Mamudun. Which, even I am still kind of confused as to why he has it, but I'm not gonna complain. Definitely makes things interesting, to say the least. Oh, your retaliate doesn't scare me. 
The fact that you won't die, though, kind of does. Damn it! Ah, thank you. Right, uh, ooh, Albion leveled up. Thank you. Good to know. Another point of vitality. Nothing much else going on there. Repel doesn't seem to be helping me at all, so I don't even think I'm going to keep using it. What I will do, though, is throw up another float ball, because I'm not interested in taking damage. Where are they? There they are. Float ball it up. And there is literally nothing in this pathway. There was that... Oh, God damn it. Is there um, a walkway down path? No. So let's go back. This was kind of a waste of time. Then again, shows just about how much I know. Alright, door, what mysteries are hidden behind you? Mm, this room, it looks like. And, oh, we're actually about to make a full loop. Interesting. Oh, I see a cash cube over there in the corner of that room. Thank you, Battle Ant- Oh god, it's your Lunger. This is the first time we're fighting your Lunger. This actually could be kind of annoying, now that I think about it, because all of these guys here are weak to force, except you completely repel or resist or nullify all forms of magic. So I will kill you first. Oh no, not the Tarukaja storm. Well, the Tarukajas actually won't help you with that. Thank God they're. I love how Tarunda can. Tarunda lowers a physical attack and magic attack, but Tarukaja only raises physical attack. Makakaja raises magical attack. It's kind of interesting how they did that. It makes debuffing actually that much more powerful compared to actual buffing. Uh, well, they all just took a big hit. Let's use. Um, actually, you know what? Let's use Mama Drain. Keep my MP up. You, on the other hand, can use Prominence. Boom! Haha, <laughs> I love that fire move. You gonna run? No, you're gonna stay and fight. Don't you dare. Thank you. Holy sweet Jesus, that would have been annoying. Oh, they're all dead. Just how I like my enemies. Dead and lying on the floor. Uh, ooh, there's an elevator there. Uh, okay then. Let's just pick up... <sighs> Damn it, game. I was going to say let's just pick up this stupid cash cube. But of course that had to happen. What is in it? Oh, nuts. Oh, God! It's Rangda. And th two Abaddons. Or Abaddons. Ow. I don't appreciate this. Tyrant Abaddon and Fem Rangda. Oh, Lord. All right, then. Let's use bullet time. Can I... Oh, jeez! Uh, Dante might go down here. Oh, God. Oh, Dante survived, but Throne was not as fortunate. Okay, don't use physical attacks on Ragna. Duly noted. <laughs> oh, God. Holy star, please. Who can I summon? I need a healer. I need a healer. Um, let's go with... Let's go with Daiso Joe. He's the only one here who I know can fix all of this in just one quick fell swoop. Use prayer. Ah, uh, not debilitate. Ow. No thank you. Holy star. Thank god holy star is so useful. I guess attack with ult storm? Oh, it's weak to electricity. That was convenient. Use Zeo. 
Ah, uh, you can miss. That works too. And by works, I mean no, it does not work. Use Hades Blast. <laughs> kind of useful for you since you already void physical attacks. Uh, oh, Daisojo's not doing too hot. And Albion's confused. Um, okay then. Round trip. How about punching? Nice, one's dead. You can use prayer again. Can we kill you? No, we can't. We got close. Uh, no hit for you. Uh, oh, I killed it. Eh, oh well. I'll worry about Daiso Joe another day. Dante leveled up, though. And learned Stinger. What does this do? Almighty. Heavy damage, fatal on one enemy. Holy crap, I want that. Never yield. Present, prevents death. One HP. Okay. Persuades an indecisive enemy. Time provoke. I'm gonna get rid of Intimidate. Give me Stinger. Uh, what's up, Dante? You've got guts, kid. I like that. And he gave me a free float ball. Cool. Thanks. Uh, I actually kind of need that for this area. Good guy Dante saving the day again. Ow, these things. I think I can just kind of go all out. Yeah, or maybe not. Not with Megiddo. That might make things slightly difficult. Uh, oh, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. And while I'm at it, let's use a Chakra Elixir on our good friend Daisojo. And have him use Meditation. Very nice. Thank you, Tauti. You proved to be quite useful in the fact that you managed to heal Daisojo there for a bit. Okay. Who has Recarm? Or Samarcarm? That's what I want. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. That is exactly what I wanted. Well, Daisojo, you were useful, but bringing back out Throne. What is up this lift? Bunch of hallway is what it is. Now uh, there's a door there. As well as more hallway. And more door. Oh, uh, there's a soul in here. Hey, oops. What do you say? Up ahead, the floor appears and disappears. If you go the wrong way, you'll get a taste of gravity. Darkness awaits you. Oh, great. Uh, yes, that means that if we go the wrong way, we'll fall through the floor into the rooms below us. Thanks for the tidbit of information, game, and... Ah, oh, nuts. Um, actually, let's not go through there. Let's go this way still. Uh, is there... Oh! A terminal! A, a, a full terminal. Huh. Okay. So that means we actually can warp through here. Tower of Kakatsuchi 1, Tower of Kakatsuchi 2. Well, alright. Fair enough, game. Fair enough. Uh... Do we want to actually go anywhere? I don't know. What's down over here? Another door. With another soul. This is one tall tower. We're only halfway up? Well, no need to worry about Isamu. He's eaten all that Magatsuhi, after all. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm worried about. Not gonna lie. Pretty worried about that. Uh, what's through here? Oh. Uh... Nothing for me to do. 
I'll say that much. Oh, God, no. No, thank you. I'm not fighting that battle. There's no way in hell you will make me fight that battle. Oh, my God, where is all of this going from? <sighs> there is seriously... Okay, so I guess I gotta go through that big double door right there. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure this door over here is just going to be more of the same. So, next time on Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne, we'll go through that door. What awaits us on the other side? Well, from these side rooms can tell us, it's apparently a whole lot of empty. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. See you guys next video.